It's so quiet you can barely hear it coming. It's just another pit stop for the 100% electric Citroën Cicero and its two French drivers, Antonin and Xavier. They're taking their electric car Odyssey on a journey around the globe, a world tour with stops every 100 kilometers to recharge. In the United States, we were really in the middle of nowhere, especially in the Rockies, where we stopped in small towns that never see tourists. We got looks from locals who were a little bewildered by our electric car. Then we arrived in Siberia, and the Russians weren't always so keen to provide us with an electrical outlet. After setting off from France in February, the two friends crossed 17 countries, clocked 24,000 kilometers, and had to recharge about 300 times. All for just 250 euros, about seven times less than what they would have paid for gasoline. They also hope to have changed some minds about electric vehicles along the way. This isn't a golf cart. It's a car that can drive on roads across the globe, deserts, the steppe, and is therefore well suited to city driving at home where conditions are far better for a smooth ride. In the southern polar city of Krakow, car lovers got to test drive this eco-friendly vehicle for themselves. With many cities here blanketed in smog, its zero emissions credentials are an attractive prospect. But the 30,000 euro price tag remains a barrier to potential buyers. It's a small electric car, but costing over 100,000 zloty, few Poles would decide to buy it. It would be a different story if it were only 50,000 zloty. It may take a few years before Poles warm up to electric cars, but with just over a week to complete the last leg of their journey, Antonin and Xavier will be hoping to convince a few more skeptical drivers.